The heavy rains in central and eastern China have had devastating effects, leading to more than 1,400 casualties and disappearances. Nearly 24 million people are grappling with the impact of flooding. In Anhui, the water levels in the main stretches of the Yangtze River and Huaihe River have exceeded their warning marks. Notably, Chaohu Lake has hit its highest water level ever recorded. Responding to the crisis, Anhui province in East China has initiated an emergency flood control period for 12 cities along the Yangtze River. This decision comes as continuous heavy rainfall wreaks havoc across the region, causing widespread damage. To address the growing flood risk, Chinese authorities have opted to dismantle a dam in eastern Anhui province. This strategic move is in response to the persistent heavy rains, which are causing rivers to swell across the nation. In the areas south of the Huaihe River in Anhui, intermittent rainfall is expected until Monday. Notably, a dam on the Chu River in Anhui was intentionally demolished on Saturday as water levels neared historic highs. The purpose behind this action was to alleviate the pressure by reducing the water level in the Chu River. By noon on Saturday, 35 rivers and lakes in Anhui had surpassed their warning water levels, including major ones like the Yangtze and Huaihe rivers. Additionally, over the weekend, the Three Gorges Dam opened three floodgates as the water level surged more than 15 meters above the flood threshold. 487 rivers across the country have overflowed, forcing the evacuation of over 1.2 million people. These floods have caused widespread chaos, submerging farmlands, disrupting power and communication systems, damaging roads, and destroying homes. Notably, the Pearl River Basin in Guangdong Province has experienced unprecedented levels of rainfall. In the flood-affected city of Maoming in Guangdong, firefighters undertook a challenging mission to rescue 14 villagers stranded in their homes amidst deep and murky floodwaters. A touching moment occurred during the rescue when a firefighter urgently requested an umbrella for a baby, ensuring the child's shelter with a plastic sheet. The overflow from the Beijiang River in the densely populated Pearl River Basin has intensified the severe flooding in the region. China is actively working on enhancing its ability to manage extreme weather events and has committed to establishing an advanced risk management and prevention system in the next decade. Notably, the country has faced more geological disasters in the first half of this year than in the entire previous year, as reported by an official from the Ministry of Natural Resources.